to uh, Smith and Slade. Yuwani. A bit of rearranged back line. You're only moving to number. Scott Figlister did really well there. Turnover for the Rebels. Terrific work. And so English, who has been playing on the wing in the setters tonight, goes to Grant. Needs quick ball, Phipps. Hegarty. Inside ball to Woodward. Woodward away from a couple and got it away to Hegarty. And he got it out to English. And Tom English! They have hit back immediately. What a try, Rebels. Wonderful hands in the back line. Wonderful interplay. There it is there. Straight through Woodward. Lovely hands. Bryce Hegarty did extremely well to get his ball away. And Tom English playing it outside centre tonight. Yeah, you could just see on the inside there. Tony Woodcock was the inside defender. They picked on him there. Again, they saw a big tight forward in the back line. They threw the inside. And it's play on. O'Connor to English. Up over halfway. O'Connor's on the inside. O'Connor. Oh, he couldn't clear. Here's Henderson. Now James O'Connor goes left, wants quick ball. And he's got it. O'Connor, couple of forwards out there. English! And English has got a double. They're back in it big time now. The Mel... They're going to get there. Watch, watch English's line. James O'Connor. Got Sean Treby interested. Number 22. Look at him half look in. And that opened up the gap. A very similar play. How James O'Connor laid on the try in the second test match in Melbourne to Adam Ashley Cooper. It's good for Reed. He just manages to hold on. And now he loses it. Picked up by English. English, 10 metres. Lau on the short side. Now they try and open it up. It's Sidey across to Hegarty, bringing Inman in. And Woodward up from fullback. Got the pass away to English. Dots it down. It's a try, I believe, for the Rebels. Cooper, he came in. It's already happened there. This is where we watch it to see if that left foot went into touch. Was he out? Was he out? Was he out? No way in the world he's in touch. That's a try. Five points, Rebels. He's already dotted down when his legs went across the chalk. Former Aussie Sevens player, Tom English, has got the first try. I love how they got Bernard Foley playing a hooker for this line out. Hooper defending at number 10. Oh, and the overthrow and Lucas picks it up and then he was absolutely crunched. So Lucas beat them. Foley now out of Ashley Cooper for Lau. And it's back on him. It's a good tackle from English and Mitchell back to Adam Ashley Cooper over half there, but he got the ball back to Beatham. Peter Beatham up against his old team and now Adam Ashley Cooper showing and then going and a good tackle from English. Higginbotham. English scored the try in the first half. Oh, it's powerful. Short side. Good defence again. English charging up. So they've got the penalty. They can have a go at anything. And it's Hegarty out wide. Caden Neville. He offloads. There it is in the corner. He's got a double. English will score for the Melbourne Rebels. You think about where that's come from in the last three minutes. 22 phases. The Waratahs head down the far side. Turnover. Higginbotham's put one into touch. They've worked their way all the way to under the post. Good opportunity here for the home team as Higgity puts it out now to English inside the 22. English with a great break. From the right wing up towards the 22. Had some good momentum too, the Rebels. Lovely break from Tom English coming through at first receiver off the scrum set piece. 10 metre mark. Carr, De Villiers, and Peterson. Tom English holds on. Good tackle. Up in Chiefs colours. Wide ball, cut out pass to Nanai Williams. That was a good tackle. Tommy English. Young winger coming through, and that's safe. They average the most line breaks per game, 6.2, as the Rebels now look for a line break, and it's 
Higginbotham, and he's got English. Higginbotham gives it to English. He steps on the inside. He pops one over the top to Higginbotham. He reaches out. Oh, we got to So he's working in a pretty good form, O'Connor. And here it is here. Well, that will be debated, I'm sure, across the Tasman as well. And now Fuglistola gives it to Pyle. He throws it out to O'Connor. Gets back to his feet. Now it's English. Oh, Tiko Rotuma went in and put a shot on him. He bounced out. Lost forward in the end. And now it's Woodward looking to go wide. Tamia Furna gets away from him. And now it's English. And English comes back in field. So the Rebels, as the ref was taken out as well. Zuna! Five metres out. O'Connor, wide they go. Inside ball, Pyle reaching out, got it down. It seemed like an eternity. James O'Connor did brilliantly, attracted about three or four defenders. You see the Chiefs pushing hard in defence. That was a lovely ball to create some space here. English pops back on the inside. It was a terrific pick and go. Position as O'Connor wants to go to the right. And he gives it now to English. There's a shoulder charge there from Tiko Rotuma. No arms in that tackle. Comes out for Phipps. Trapped there. And it's English having a crack. So after all that very good work... The Rebels find themselves 5-0 down. Although you can see they've come through and they've got very close to scoring. And he's capable of playing in the pivot roll. Fips to the short side. And O'Connor, and that pass has fallen nicely for English. And he skips his way through a couple inside the 22. We'll play it. And here they come, and Woodward is looking dangerous. English spins out of the first tackle possession Sam Whitelock made the tackle pile offloading Woodward this is looking dangerous gets it away to English chance to come inside and went through the tackle too of Israel Dag